Alright. Alright guys, how's everybody doing today? I'm doing well, thank you for asking. Welcome to the last, hopefully, episode of this little painting that I'm doing on the Body Beatdown. I'm Michael, your incredible host. Let me do a quick share real quick on my Facebook. Not that anybody's going to watch number one. Nobody takes part in what I do anyway. Number two, uh, a lot of people are at work right now. share that right there <clears throat> and uh, let's get this over and done with as quickly as we can so what I've decided to do oh again this uh, my wife has epilepsy and uh, the seahorse is the mascot for epilepsy you can Type in seahorse epilepsy, whatever, and you'll go. You can find their website on there. And the little seahorse's name is Campy. And uh, anyway, so my wife wanted me to paint her a seahorse. Now I didn't acknowledge her really saying it. I didn't say I was going to or anything. And uh, so this is uh, this is kind of a surprise for her that I've been working on the last few days. So uh, we're pretty much finishing up here. I got the seahorse done. Uh, today I'm just gonna add like some seaweed or something coming up here <laughs> maybe a flower on it a little something like so uh, maybe a little dot little dots with my iridescent glitter glue just a little something just for some interest on the background a little bit and uh, I think we're gonna call it done okay so Let's uh, let's see what we can do with a little bit of some green or Vindian or whatever whatever color they want to call this. Do I want green? I could go and do whatever color I wanted. You know, any color I want, I could do. We could always add some color to it and spice it up a little bit if we want. That's what's good about paint. You do whatever you want for the most part. And by the way, I am not a professional painter. I am not a professional artist in the least. I did grow up uh, from childhood drawing like a cartoon, you know, like muscle, muscle guys and barbarians, He-Man, stuff like that. And uh, th that is my preferred art. You know, I love that kind of stuff, the cartooning and that kind of stuff. And I've never followed my passion the way I should. If I'd spent as much time with art as I have with other things, I'd probably be good. And uh, I wish I would have. Well, we're going to give it a shot, guys. And yeah, I'm doing my paint a little different than some. I'm just kind of blobbing it on this brush. And, uh, and we'll go from there. Uh, hope you can see a little bit. I wish I had to put it on the other side. Daggummit. Oh, well. Let's just run with it, guys.
I'm going to leave it kind of raised up off the canvas there. Give it some texture. That's how the seahorse is as well. He's got a lot of texture. do anything crazy Uh, paint right there. So how many here are going to watch that Eddie Hall, whatever, Thor boxing match coming up this weekend? It's for free. You can find it for free on some, uh, whatever, uh, where they're going to be streaming it. Uh, they're offering it for free. No charge, no nothing. So, can't beat free. I think that's about all it'll be worth. I happen to like Thor better. I think he's a little bit, uh, he took it a lot more serious, lost a lot of weight. He's been training super hard. He looks really good. Eddie, to me, is just a fat, you know, rude kind of, I don't know, person. I don't know either one of them, but if I had to judge him by just what I've seen, uh, I'm, I'm for Thor winning, but I have a feeling Eddie's got. He's shorter, but he's fatter, and he's got some power, so he might he might get Thor's midsection real good and knock him out. So, uh, I may watch it. I may. I may watch it. I don't know. So, I know it's kind of cliche what I've done here. We'll put some on this side and then we'll put some on this side and we kind of frame the picture like so, but eh, I can't really have it coming up here because then you're going to cover up the seahorse. So, you got to kind of do the cliche thing and do what you do. I am going to mix a little different colors in there with it, I believe. A little something. And uh, see what we get. I'm going to put some magenta off in there. Magenta. A little magenta. Just to see what we get. If I don't like it, I can get rid of it. Just adds a little bit of interest to it.
gives it a little bit of something other than just green, you know, a flat green. Where do you, where do you go, my lovely? <coughs> I want to know, where do you go? Oh, 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 where do you go? Oh, 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 oh. Where do you, where do you go, 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 go? Hmm. I might do a little something, 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 something right there. A little something, 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 guys. I don't know. Let me see. I think this one's open. Yeah, it's open. All right. Try and keep this kind of subtle. Gives it a little something to look at, you know. A little bit of visual stimulation. And I'm okay with that. It looks all right. Not bad. A little visual pow. A little bit of that pow wow. I'm getting excited. I'm ready to finish this, guys. Hope you can see it pretty decent. This is my iridescent glitter. So, at this point, I'm just going to kind of make little random dots on the painting. I hope it works all right. If not, I can probably go over it pretty easily. Probably. Probably. Maybe. Open it up. really like to take this off of there and get in the way. Let me practice. Okay. <laughs> I practiced.
Okay. All right. Okay. Got the old hair dryer out quick, didn't I? Hopefully it's going to have a little bit more glitter effect. I don't see much glitter. Come on, glitter. coming out of there. They'll look very glittery. Good breeze. What a big dead gum dummy. paintbrush for blue. It's good to give your paintings and stuff a little texture. <clears throat> I like some texture.
hope everybody's having a good Monday. So far, so good with me. I am a little off schedule from my normal morning routine. I did do my walk and I've had my breakfast, but I always, nine times out of ten, uh, I spin after I eat. But I thought I'd go ahead and do this since my wife had to open this morning and she's out of the house. That'll give me a chance to work on this. Then I can spin in a little bit. Surprised that glue's not dry yet. I know this is a little bit annoying, but it's kind of a part of it. You gotta kind of do this to. So we can kind of keep going. from there. <clears throat> what I might do is put just a tad bit of this red on top of it. If I can open it. Let me open you please. That's what she said. I might should wait for it to dry. It's not wanting to it's not wanting to do right because uh, the glue is still a little bit the other glue glitter is still a little bit damp and so it's wanting to kind of mess up and then this glob here
is really wanting to mess up. Heaven forbid I want you to dry. Wouldn't want you to dry. Jeez. Dry, would you? Kind of tricky, guys. A little bit tricky. Little bit on the tricky side. Run DMC said it better. You know, they said it better than I did. think so. Hmm. Probably be better to have the canvas laying flat. And this one here is just going to be blobbing. That's going to give me problems. You know, you gotta kind of experiment with stuff. blown away that that's still not dry at all. Just a little bit surprised.
that's a very slow drying glue. Guys, I'm sorry that this is kind of where we're at right now, but these little blobs are not cooperating. about that probably just about all she wrote I think I'm going to hold the canvas down like this for now, guys, and kind of do this. I know you probably won't get to see it very well.
Oh, good grief. <laughs> A whole dang. That's crazy. That just caused me some problems right there. We'll see how that does. So I'm going to have to let this dry guys. Uh, kind of let these dots dry um, so they'll quit running All right, we'll leave it at that. I kind of got little bubbles, little iridescent glitter bubbles all over. Uh, got little bulbs on the little flower things. and So we're going to let this dry, guys. And uh, this will probably be the end result. So, uh, and I got to finish the, I got to go over this bottom piece like I did here. Uh, all the other edges, I got to go over that edge there. But I'm going to set this flat and let this dry. And uh, uh, we may pick up one more video just to showcase it. So, all right, guys, I appreciate you tuning in if you did. If not, don't feel bad. Uh, explore your uh, artistic side because it can help with mental problems such as depression, anxiety, even epilepsy. Things like that. It can calm you down. And uh, it's a good way to uh, just relax and enjoy your day. So um, thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff to the Body Beat Down, my channel. My channel. All right? Don't forget, get up, get out, get rad, do it to it, and we'll see you next time on the Body Beat Down. Be awesome and stay awesome. Bye.